this week we're gonna walk through overcoming obstacles and opposition. Maybe you're facing some obstacles and opposition. Nehemiah certainly was. In Nehemiah chapter 4, verse 1, we read that a man named Sanballat heard that Nehemiah and the team, they were rebuilding the wall. And so Sanballat was angry, he was incensed, and he started to ridicule them and their project. And maybe you've been at a point where you start a work for the Lord. It's a new season. It's a breakthrough. You're so excited. You've given up a lot to do this. And someone comes in and ridicules you. And not only did Sanballat do it alone, but he started to spread that word amongst his associates. And if you've ever faced that situation, it's so discouraging and yet it's realistic. Nehemiah had given up a lot, his position in Persia, traveled for months, arrived at the wall, has the team, has the supplies, and then here comes the discouragement. So if you're facing that today, you know, we're going to walk through some of that this week, but I just want to tell you right away, don't give those people too much power. You know who the people are that bring the negativity, that are not for God or his work. Don't give them too much power. Don't listen to them for too long. And even if they spread a false report about you, you can't control that. But instead, continue the good work. Don't give in to that trap of discouragement, but let their work, that antagonistic work, let it fuel you forward so that you become even more focused on serving the Lord and bringing him glory.